addition to inversions, another quote unquote cousin of MMD is the reversal. Uh, one easy reversal to do is backwards walking. Backwards walking can actually work out different muscles, help with posture, expand spatial awareness, and even just be a fun parlor trick when doing randomly while walking across the street. Of course, with walking backwards, the major concern is not tripping over or colliding with anything. And the easiest way to prevent this is to practice while walking alongside a friend who's walking in the normal direction who can just watch out for anything that might be in your way. Now, it's of course walking backwards by yourself that adds that extra exercise of spatial awareness. When walking solo, you want to alternate your look backs on odd numbered steps, exhaling with each turn whether that's on your third, fifth, seventh, or even ninth step. Walking with a water bottle can help you keep track of which side you're turning on, uh, acting as a sort of mental anchor. It can also help with subtle rehabilitation of one weaker side over the other, and the heavier the water bottle, the more readjustment you'll feel over a longer walk. You can focus the weight of the water bottle more on your forward swing or your backward swing as you're walking, which adds up over time, especially on longer walks. And I'll also use this water bottle anchor weight method when longboarding. The water bottle helps me easily remember what side I'm switching to between my stances and pushes, ensuring that I stay more balanced in repetitions throughout a long ride. It also helps me bring a little more power into my pushes by incorporating my arm muscles into the workout, 